Hey guys, I, uh, you know, I, I know my other ri v video, I ranted and I raved, I, I'm sorry about that, I, you know, I, I just, I can't stand people just throwing away money. Well, I'm thinking about financing, uh, small condos, you know, $50,000 less. And uh, so I can rent them out like a hotel room with uh, Airbnb. I think I can get at least three thousand, maybe four thousand dollars a month on the Airbnb for the rentals if I can get a decent, uh, you know, like. In Daytona, I think they're going for like sixty-five thousand dollars for one bedroom, one bath. You know, I knew they. You know, it's you know the mortgage will be lower than the, the uh, condo fees, but I think if I can do it right, you know, um, twenty percent down of uh, of of uh, $30,000 is $6,000 for the condo. Or less, you know, I got good credit. Maybe they will go down to, uh, you know, 10, 15, maybe 5% down. Uh, I might even go hard money if it, you know, it's cheap enough at 6%, 7 or 8%. Just to get the condo, then I'll refinance the loan, and this way, you know, uh, this way I can just get the, you know, I, I probably have to clean up these places, the condos. I, I gotta watch the condo fees. Oh, taxes seem like they're cheap enough. So, you know, then again, you can write off the taxes you know, on, you know, at the end of, uh, tax season, so I don't have to worry about that. All I have to worry about is high condo fees and, you know, the, uh, mortgage, but, you know, you know, I, I'm, I got to do the numbers. I still want some you know, cash flow, so I ha have to do it, so, you know, and I I might have, you know, I might just go with all cash if I can get something halfway decent, about th twenty five thirty thousand dollars $30,000, maybe off the beach or on the beach in Daytona Beach. Uh, I don't know yet. I, like I said, D don't know yet, but I, uh, you know, I, I'm just making this video because I'm really <laughs> thinking outside the box, and maybe you should too. Uh, condos are real cheap in Florida. Um, you know, uh, all the expenses, um, you know, the condo fees, but. Hey, listen, you you get a condo for around 30, dollars $30, in West Palm Beach, and uh, you rent that out, you know, uh, during the season, and pays for the uh, taxes and the condo fees, and eventually, maybe they will go up, and maybe if they will not nah, because you know but the thing is cash flow if you know then you can rent rent it out for nine fifty thousand dollars a month in the uh you know 1200 maybe in west palm beach i'm just thinking out of the box you know you know buying a uh house now where I live is going up in price and uh, 
I'm looking, you know, I, I got to do something with the cash when I get my bonus in uh, November. So, uh, yeah, I'm really thinking about, you know, Daytona. Um, you know, I just have to find someone to pay the uh, condo fees and the taxes. And I get, get it cheap enough that, you know, Dama dozen uh, condos down here in Florida, or Dama dozen. So you know, if I can get a decent condo in uh, you know Daytona, West Palm Beach, Miami, you know something small, one bedroom, one bedroom, room, one bath, maybe two bedroom, one bath with. Sm you know, uh, 650 square foot, or 850, uh, and I can rent that out with, uh, you know, treat it like a hotel room, like, uh, you know, like, uh, you know, Airbnb, um, you know, then, you know, get the little cash flow going. You know, 500 bucks a month on cash flow, that's pretty good. So, you know, so they're cheap enough, you know. You know, uh, condo living is like timeshares. So, uh, I'm thinking about it. Um, uh, right now, I, I'm looking at houses and if they're going up in Florida. And the the uh, cash flow is, uh, t you know, isn't there anymore. So, you know, I might look at a couple houses in um, Ocala, um, no, Orlando and Camp, uh, and uh, downtown uh, Daytona, but. Like I said, those houses are in the trap areas, so I re I really think I should, you know, uh, um, maybe um, invest in those small condos down there and pick them up dirt cheap. You can see it see it online. Uh, they're going for like fifty forty five. 60, you can bring them down to 40, you know, um, you know, clean up paint, uh, say about $3,000, you know, I just, you just have to, um, uh, you just have to, uh, you know, look at the, uh, uh, you know, uh, condo fees a month. And they're running around about, say, around three fifty, four hundred dollars a month. So with a, you know, so you, you, let's do the math. If you go or I go, you know, push this, this condo, and I, 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 you know, treat it like a hotel room, like you know, on Airbnb, and make. 20% minus uh, the condo fees, the taxes. I might might be able to get like 14, 13, 12% on my money uh, in 10 years. Um, you know, so, you know, I'm not looking to flip the uh, things. I'm looking for the cash flow. So, you know, 12, 13 percent on your money is pretty good. Yeah, but you gotta do the numbers. But, you know, I'm looking at them, at them online. You know, I might go to Daytona next week, look at them, and see what what's going on. So, okay, guys, that's my update. See ya.